the next time you're off on a training ride and you think you're ready for a, for a peloton, run this next two minutes through your memory. This is unedited hammering. Put all the action in an 11 day bike race into a 90 minute video isn't easy. To give you an idea, the action you just saw for the last two minutes went on for an hour. Leading that chase was Helvetia in course, and it didn't take long to wipe out that one minute gap. Soon the whole pack was heading into downtown Richmond. The fans on hand at the finish were treated to a three-lap circuit, but no one told the Sayur rider. <laughs> then on the last lap, it was another classic Motorola train. Bill Anderson of Motorola may have confidently thrown his hand up in victory, but I don't think he realized how close Bob Mianski was to stealing this race. Approaching the final 100 meters, Ron Kiefel was giving his classic lead out, and like old times, Davis jumped on his wheel. This is where Finney lost the race. Kiefel was done pulling through and was slowing up. Anderson was starting to come around, and Finney was boxed. Mianski, far right, was coming off Nico Verhoeven's wheel. Riding unobstructed, he nearly won the throw. So Motorola grabbed the headlines in the first stage of the day, 